Hi friends and welcome back to the Baseball Card Illustrated channel. I'm Bronco with the PSA 11, Kevin is resting in his recliner, and Mark McGuire and Wally Joyner's starting lineups have joined us on set because this is Mystery Mondays, the weekly series where you have a chance to win the prize package of your choice. All you have to do is be a public subscriber to the channel, leave a comment on this video by 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time Friday, and mention the mystery word, player name, or phrase I will give you later in this video along with letting us know which prize package you would like if the prize wheel spins in your favor and lands on your name. I will give you the captains for the mystery envelopes you can win in a moment, but first, let's select a winner from last week's video. Last week was a battle of slugger Ryan Braun and Ichiro, whose prize package we ran back because he was crushed in an unfair fight against Jose Canseco a week ago. Interestingly enough, this time we have our closest contest finish ever, an 8-8 tie. Now let's see if the winner is of this prize package headlined by the player of their choice. So we'll get the background out of the way. We'll move Ichiro and Ryan Braun off the field. We'll knock over Wally Joyner, who was nice enough to get back up. And I'll let you know that our competitors this week are not applicable. Topps Vintage 316, who really wants the Ichiro prize package. He was the only person to select it last week against Jose Canseco. Brewers Cards Forever. Malone Money Mindset. Jack Smith. Brandon Stebbins, who I'll come back to in a moment here. Tony Black. Mets Rule. Michael Myers. George the Collector. Steve Rademacher. The one and only Bud Stoney. Rob Sports Talks. Big Mike Sports, Math Bowler, and Hunt Show Pop. So with all that out of the way, let's spin the wheel and find out who is the winner of the prize package of their choice, if I can hit the right button there. We've added a little extra time to the wheel spin just for fun. I don't know if that makes any difference or not, but it looks like the winner of our prize package this week is... Is it going to make it one more? It is! It's Steve Rademacher. Congratulations, Steve! So Steve is the winner, and he has selected the prize package of Ryan Braun. So first, let's uh, take a look at Ichiro and see that Ichiro's prize package is not going to be going out to a winner again this week. Although this time it was an 8-8 tie, so there were certainly opportunities. We have another first baseman joining McGuire and Wally Joyner, who I should point out were not part of the prize package. We had a Ryan Howard rookie card. We have a name on front Frank Thomas card. We had a Nick Solak rookie card from 2020 Tops, along with this 1986 Tops traded version of Barry Bonds. So those were the cards that will not be going out to the winner, Steve Rademacher, as I try carefully to get these cards out of the way. And Wally Joyner almost got knocked down again. And as I put the backdrop up, I mentioned Brandon Stebbins, uh, Stebbins, I should say, a minute ago. And the reason for that is he said we should go after the score set and try to get all the cards signed. So yesterday on a trip to the local card store, picked up one of these. It is the complete set of 1990s score. We've got about 25, I think it is, cards signed so far through the mail on our Through the Mail Thursday. So I don't know how well this group of players is going to stand with this and how well this is going to look. So I guess Wally Joyner and Mark McGuire are going home early. But anyway, now that I mentioned that, we have the nice backdrop here. I'm going to point out that we have the Ryan Braun card, which I have somehow managed to misplace. There it is. So Steve, congratulations. Ryan Braun is coming to you. I'm going to take it out of the top loader here, hoping that that makes it a little bit better glare-wise, which, there, I think we're good now. So, in addition to Brawny, we've got this prize envelope here, which we'll crack into. Of course, we always blow into the envelope like Karnak the Great, or the Magnificent, I should say, Karnak the Magnificent of Tonight Show with Johnny Carson fame. And I'll let you know that along with Ryan Braun, you've got, well, look at that. It's Mark McGuire. Well, there, now you can look at him. So 
Big Mac there going out to uh, Steve along with Ryan Braun. Trying to figure out a way here to put Mark McGuire in the photo here or uh, the shot. But we also got a Randy Johnson card, a rookie card from the upper deck set. We've got a All-Star Game Futures Relic, a game-used jersey card of Gavin Floyd. And going back to first base, we have not Wally Joyner. Rather, this Pete Alonzo rookie card. So congratulations, Steve. And to all of our previous winners, um, now that we've done that, I do want to let you know that we have something exciting, very exciting coming up very soon, hopefully, as we are near our 200th subscriber. Hopefully we can achieve that by having a pair of prize packages this week with rookie cards of a future Hall of Famer. But before I unveil those players, just a reminder to Andrew the Master Cards and Tiger 727 that you guys won in recent weeks and we have not heard from you. So we'd like to get your prize packages out sent your way. Um, Jose Canseco there was the captain of a prize package won by Tiger 727. And Garrett Cole's rookie card was won by Andrew the Master Cards a few weeks ago. So please send us a, or I should say leave a comment on this video letting us know how we can contact you, either an email address or giving us um, a mailing address and we'll get the prize package out to you right away. Um, so now that we've done all of that, let's take a look at this week's prize package, Captains. I'm trying to put the cards back in the Garrett Cole envelope here. Please give me one second to do that. I wanna keep these together so that when we hear from the winners of those, we get those right out. We'll clear the deck here as these guys leave the field. And there we go. And now, finally, Team One featuring one of my favorite players and cards ever. A lot of great memories of this guy right here, Ken Griffey Jr., the kid with his 1989 Donruss rookie card. Had a bunch of those because my grandfather bought a couple boxes of those for me as a kid as a little incentive. Uh, prizes to get me to do better in school and uh, get my homework done and stuff like that, behave in class and all those fun things. And then his birthday and other gifts. So have a bunch of these cards and want to share one of them with you. So Ken Griffey Jr. 1989 Donruss rookie card could be yours if you select that prize package along with this envelope here. And now before I unveil the team captain for Prize package number two, I need to give you the mystery word, player name, or phrase. Remember, you must be a public, public subscriber to the channel and leave a comment on this video by Friday at 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time mentioning fumble, as in the youth football team Bronco coaches lost five fumbles in last week's game. Yeah, it was pretty depressing, not going to lie. <laughs> Lost 20 to 12, a uh, very good game other than the uh, fumbling problem. So fumble is the word, mystery word, player name, or phrase you need to have along with letting us know which prize package you would like if you are selected. And before we continue on to prize package number two and the captain there, I should let you know that we will be having a very special Mystery Monday giveaway coming up once we hit 250 subscribers. We're getting sort of into that neighborhood. Details will be given at the appropriate time, but we will remind you of that a few times between now and whenever that happens because it will be a Mystery Monday episode that will be a bit different than this one, which features a lot of fun and a great selection of prizes. So Kevin and I just want to make sure that you are, those of you that have been with us from the very beginning are well aware that we have something extra special planned in the, as I said, hopefully near future. Now on to Captain... Number two, team captain number two, and that'll be appropriate when you see who it is because it is this guy here, the captain, number two from the New York Yankees, and we got the glare out of the way there. It's Derek Jeter. So this Derek Jeter 1993 Tops card could be headed your way along with this mystery envelope right here. If you select that prize is what you'd like to win, and of course the wheel spins in your favor next week. As always, we here at Baseball Card Illustrated appreciate your support 
We thank you for watching, subscribing, and liking our videos along with commenting. So, on behalf of Ryan Braun, and Ichiro, Derek Jeter, Ken Griffey Jr., not to mention surprise visits from Wally Joyner, <laughs> or not. He, he had a little bit too much fun in the Baseball Card Illustrated Green Room before uh, we uh, started taping, and Mark McGuire, and of course on behalf of there we go, I got him to stand finally, even though you can't see all of them. <laughs> On behalf of Kevin the Diamond King and our graphics guru Dylan, I'm Bronco, the PSA 11. Hope you enjoyed this random look of Wally Joyner falling repeatedly, and we thank you for watching the Baseball Card Illustrated channel.